ES Kids. Helping kids discover that families and fun go hand in hand. PBS Kids, where a kid can be a kid. And by contributions to your PBS station from viewers like you. Thank you. I think Bingo wants to play a game with us. Yeah. <laughs> How about hide and seek? Ooh. That is one of Bingo's favorite games, and one of mine too. Uh, Me too. Well, then let's give it a try. Okay, hiders and seekers. On your marks, get set, go! <laughs> Every parent needs a helping hand. Barney brings the essential development skills your child needs for learning through educational activities and play. Many young children have pets, and these animal friends help teach children kindness and responsibility. In today's episode, Barney and his friends share the day with some of their favorite furry friends, dogs. Tony and the children learn that it's important to ask an adult before approaching or petting a dog, and that all pets should be handled gently and carefully. Barney and Mr. Boyd help the children learn responsibility by teaching them how to care for Bingo. Together, they share the duties of feeding, watering, and playing with Bingo. Pets depend on their owners to love and care for them. Help your child learn to care for a pet. Teach them how to feed their goldfish, take their dog for a walk, or brush their cat. These activities will help them learn responsibility, kindness, and love. Barney, a helping hand for growing children. To learn more about Barney and Friends, visit PBS online at pbskids.org. Sneezing is something everybody does. Oh, can you sneeze in a funny way? <laughs> now, can you show me the right way to sneeze? Oh, that's better. Barney and Friends was made possible by... Chuck E. Cheese's. Proud supporters of PBS Kids. Opening the door to all the fun and joy of learning. PBS Kids. Where a kid can be a kid. And by contributions to your PBS station from viewers like you. Thank you. PBS Kids! Hi, I'm Caillou, and I like to play in my fun toy theater. Let's play a game about ABCs and one, two, threes. A is for apple. B has one apple. B is for banana. She has two bananas. C is for cherry. She has a bunch of cherries. Come back and play with me again on PBS Kids. Funding for this morning's programming is provided by the Helena Rubinstein Foundation, a longtime supporter of outstanding children's television. My favorite Sesame Street memory is probably listening to Bob McGrath perform the song Sing. Which of these bowls has more spoons? Can you decide? Lipton Noodle Soup is proud to support Clifford the Big Red Dog and invites you to use your noodle. Clifford is made possible in part by the makers of Danimals Yogurt, proud to help kickstart your child's growth and development for life. Chuck E. Cheese's, proud supporter of PBS Kids, helping children discover the fun of developing their bodies and their minds. 
PBS Kids, where a kid can be a kid. And by contributions to your PBS station from viewers like you. Thank you. Best red dog on your block. Visit your local library to discover all kinds of books, both big and small. Dig up more fun with Clifford and his friends at pbskids.org or America Online keyword PBS Kids. When you get itchy, I can't stop scratching for something really fun. Never fear, Super T-Bone is here. And you want to play and dance? Nice moves. Join Clifford and his friends. You're going to be great. Catch Clifford the Big Red Dog. Clifford is funded in part by a ready-to-learn grant from the U.S. Department of Education through the Corporation for Public Broadcasting. Which of these bowls has more spoons? Can you decide? Lipton Noodle Soup is proud to support Clifford the Big Red Dog and invites you to use your noodle. Clifford is made possible in part by the makers of Danimals Yogurt, proud to help kickstart your child's growth and development for life. Chuck E. Cheese's, proud supporter of PBS Kids, who know of all the things a kid can learn, one of the most important is learning to laugh. PBS Kids, where a kid can be a kid. And by contributions to your PBS station from viewers like you. Thank you. Dragon Tales. It's new and it's next, right here on 13. Fish. Beast. Ernie! Ernie! Ernie? Catch the all-new Sesame Street. Hmm? Ernie, get down from there. Okay, Bert. Hmm? Expect surprises. Weekdays at 7 a.m. on 13. Major funding for this morning's programming is provided by the Helena Rubinstein Foundation, a longtime supporter of outstanding children's television. Coming up next on Dragon Tales. The Big Sky Relay will begin shortly. Go, go, go! Wheezy, watch out! <laughs> I'm never racing again. What? <laughs> Kellogg's Frosted Flakes, where they know that the fun of playing and learning together is more than just good, it's great! Dragon Tales is funded in part by a grant from the Corporation for Public Broadcasting through funds from the U.S. Department of Education. Why can't we go straight, Ducky? Too much padding! Ah! Come on now, get on your feet. We're gonna sing some songs and shake to the beat. Here we go, we're ready to start. Dragon tunes, dragon tunes. Let's all sing some dragon tales, too. Come on, everybody. We're gonna get up and stir. Reach your arms up to the sky There's no telling just how high You can go When you try Come on and stretch Reach way down and touch your toes Let's see how far you can go and you'll only know if you try. Oh, stretch! So stretch your arms out wide and rock from side to side. 
to side. And bend your knees nice and easy. Take it slow. Cause you know there's no need to rush it, rush it or push it, push it on your toes. There you go. Do the best you can do. And be the best you can be. Come on and stretch. Oh, reach your arms up to the sky. So much fun singing and dancing with everyone. So let's go back with all our friends where the adventures never end. Dragon Land, Dragon Land. To learn more about Dragon Tales, visit us at pbskids.org. <laughs> Kellogg's Frosted Flakes, where they know that the fun of playing and learning together is more than just good, it's great! Dragon Tales is funded in part by a grant from the Corporation for Public Broadcasting through funds from the U.S. Department of Education. We know there are a lot of TV shows out there that you could be watching. Hello! Hello up there! I'm about to change the channel. With all the competition out there, look at that. We're really glad that you keep watching Arthur. I like it. Weekdays at 8.30 a.m. and 4 p.m. on 13. Hey, everybody. What's for lunch? Use your imagination. What's in that? Anything you want. And steak, letters, and stories, dinosaurs, and ballet slippers, <laughs> robots, and stars, you name it, try some, won't you? Wow, a robot caveman! Whoa, ballerina astronaut! Great! What's the steak for? My lunch! <laughs> 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 Two, three, four, five! Give me five! Five down low! Five, five times! One, two, three, four, five! High five! Don't leave me hanging. Postcards from Buster is funded in part by a ready-to-learn television